Good morning. Uh, my name is Jesse. This is my wife, Diane. This is, and this is Matthew, Natalie, and Maddie. And we are the Tappan family. We recently moved to the, the church from so Salt Lake City, where we were a part of the Salt Lake Christian Church. And we are happy to be a part of the South Sound Christian Church family. Um, my wife will have a scripture to read for us. Yes. Yeah, so the scripture is from uh, Joshua chapter 1, verse 9. It says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. As we said, we look forward to getting to know everybody, and we look forward to being able to see everybody in person. And uh, we appreciate the welcome that we have received, and we look forward to, to continue to learn and grow with the church here. Thank you. and my kids and I are going to do the story of Jesus and the miraculous catch. Today, we'll find out we are followers of Jesus. It means we love Jesus and learn from him about how to live. The story is from Luke 5, starting in verse 1. One day, as Jesus was standing by the lake of Gesseret, the people were crowded around him and listening to the word of God. He saw at the water's edge two boats there left by fishermen who were washing their nets. I did you know that Jesus can actually tell you from the word of strength. He got into one of the boats, the one belonging to Simon, and asked him to put it out a little from shore. He sat down and caught the people from the boat. Simon answered, We haven't got caught in anything ever since. How can, how can you be so sure that we'll catch anything now? But they believed Jesus and put down their nets. When they pulled up their nets, they were surprised by the sight. <gasps> it's a miracle. How did that happen? They caught a large number of fish that their nets began to break and their boat began to sink. <gasps> That's incredible. When Simon Peter saw this, he fell to Jesus' knees. And said, go away from me. Go away from me. I'm a sinful man. For he and all his companions were astonished at the catch of fish they had taken. And so were James and John, the sons of Zebedee, Simon's partners. <gasps> How could this happen? Then Jesus said to Simon, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. From now on. From now on. You will fish for people. You will fish for people. So they pulled their boats up to shore. Left everything. And followed Jesus. We will follow you, Jesus. Yes, we will. And serve you faithfully. The end. One day, Jesus was by the Sea of Galilee. There were crowds around him because everyone wanted to hear the Word of God. And God loves each and every one of you. And you should love one another. Yes! Yay! Yay! Yeah! I love you, dog! 
<laughs> oh, cat, I love you too. Jesus noticed the two boats offshore. Jesus came aboard Simon's boat. And furthermore, God will lead you through life's challenges, just like the boat leads Simon through storms. Simon the fisher hog, take your boat into the deep sea. Put your nets in the water and you will catch some fish. But Jesus, we worked hard all night trying to catch fish and didn't catch a one. Although, Master, if you say to put the nets in the water, I will. Simon and Jesus took the boat out into the deep water. Heading out to sea, a fisher hog's life for me. Heading out with Jesus to catch some fish. But I don't know how many fish there'll be. Okay, Jesus, here's the deep water. Every time we pulled up our nets, we found tin cans, an old shoe, a soggy hat, a few tennis balls, even a message in a bottle, but no fish. I think even the seagulls were laughing at us. Ha <laughs> ha! See, there he is. I don't know how much different it'll be today. Trust me, Simon, I know the way. Simon lowered the net into the sea. So, how long should we wait? Fish! Just then, the net started to fill up with fish. So many fish, the net started to tear. Woohoo! So many fish! I can't believe this miracle you've done! Simon called to their friends in the other boat to come and help them. Both boats were filled so full, they were almost sinking. Jesus, you shouldn't have even helped me since I didn't believe you. Don't worry, Simon. From now on, you will be fishing for people. As soon as their boats reached the shore, they left everything and followed Jesus.
Every day, all the way, all the way, I will take a stand.